many companies start by just dipping their toes into AI. That's what we do with every other new technology out there. But getting to real value is a much longer and much challenging journey. How does EGEN help organizations move from those early experiments all the way to the finish line? Well, it starts with understanding at its, at its core, it's understanding the business, Swapnil. It's understanding all of the parties, all of the people, you know, what the organization looks like, uh, right down to what those workflows are that they work with. Well, what are the crown jewels? And that might be um, accepting, you know, finance applications. It might be, you know, uh, validating credit applications. Um, you think of, of anything any of us does on a daily basis. It might be booking flights. It might be rebooking flights. Um, those are very complex processes behind the scenes, and that's something that you know uh, EGN has a lot of experience of. But we also spend a lot of time understanding what those are first and foremost. You know, it, it takes a long time before the likes of me will turn up at a customer and say, you know, you want to adopt Gemini, or you should really look at Vertex, or Anthropic is a really good solution here, because throwing out technology. And I think you you talked about this earlier, Swapnil. When you have a big enough hammer, everything looks like a nail. Um, EGEN spends a lot of time understanding a business before we make recommendations. And listen, we've turned up at customers where we've said, listen, you know, there isn't really a lot of scope for adopting these kinds of AI-based tools because uh, good heuristic solutions exist. But where, where we do find that um, th that sweet spot where we're not solving a cheap problem with expensive technology, which happens to be, I think, a case in lots of AI initiatives, then what we do is we sit down with the customer as peers and we walk them through the workflow where we're going to start. And again, starting small, imagine, for example, a, pro a work business workflow that has seven steps. We're looking at one step and we say, how can we improve that? OK, now that we've improved that, now that we know it's valid. And again, a good use case for those business leaders out there is where success is understood. You know when it's failing and you know when it's, it's passing and building up from there. Now, that's a difficult that, that's not necessarily a difficult process, swap now, but it's one that requires patience. Because again, I think we've been led to believe that um, uh, through the AI zeitgeist, that sprinkling some AI on top of something inst yields instant returns. It doesn't work like that. And I think it'll be a long time before it, before it does. But for now, it's it's like any other piece of technology in a way, Swapnil. Understand the problem, understand what success looks like, and be patient. 